What's going on, everybody? PSA reveal. I think it's total of three, six, nine cards. Nine cards in this order. This was a fifteen dollars special. Just came back, and wow, um, some of the grades shocked me to be honest. Uh, some of them I kind of figured were where they were going to be at. I will just say this: one really shocked me. One I was like eh, puzzled, but I'm like I'll still take type deal. So we'll start with the one I didn't think about. Look at this. This was still encased by Panini. Came back to seven. I mean, overall, not mad because back then those one touches did shake around a lot. This is number now 25, Kevin Durant auto. I really thought it was a good nine, to be honest, on to it. A seven just, it, it baffles me. It almost, you know, to the point where I want to crack it and resubmit it. But I think I'm just going to throw this up on eBay as a 99 set auction. And hopefully it covers back my about 150 bucks I have into it with, uh, um, what do you call it, uh, grading. So, so as you can see, even so often I get something crazy, I'm like, I, I don't get it. All right, up next, I graded this just because it's blue. You guys know I like to collect the blues, but it's Malik Willis, select blue rookie. I think it's premier, no, sweet level, sweet level. Um... This here's more just something to throw on eBay and take to the show just because I'm close to the Titans. Maybe I get 20, 30 bucks for it. I, I have no idea. I haven't looked up any of these prices. Uh, next one, another select. A nine as well. Bailey Zappi Gold, Prism Phenom, numbered out of 10. A base sold for like 110 or 120, something like that, of this card. So let's toss it up there. Number four. I don't know if that's jersey number or not because I do see a four here. So, it could be jersey number, all as I know. But, uh, some people it matters, some people it don't. But, throw it up on eBay, let it sit there for a while. Maybe it'll sell, maybe it won't. <clears throat> up next, pick this up. I think it's a show, honestly. If I didn't pick this up at a show, I got it off of whatnot. I cannot remember now. But, yeah, I came back at 9. 9 real good for Spectra, Hyper. Aiden Hutchinson, numbered out of 75. A lot of people still hyped up on this guy. So with football season come up, the idea was to start grading that stuff along with basketball, especially the new product releases. Get it first in, first out, make some money. Use it for down-the-road type deal. All right, up next, these were no shot. Well, actually, uh, the one I was kind of shocked. We'll talk about that here in a second. Dominic Wilkins. 2021 Recon, Claim to Fame, Purple Signature out of 25, 9. Exactly where I put this at, being a 9 onto it. Um, just having Hall of Fame autographs in a display case usually help out, bringing some attention. Up next, I really didn't expect to get a 9 on this. I thought it was going to be an 8. Dwayne Wade, Purple. I can't complain. I mean, you got me on Durant, but they gave me a 9 on Dwayne Wade. One thing I don't like... Look where the label is on this, and you can't... Oh, I lied. It did go back in place. Ha! Huh. Never mind. We just did the movement of the label itself. These bigger, thicker cases, to watch it, guys. These labels move around in them. But Dwayne Wade, Volcanic, I believe this is out of 35? Yeah, 35. But PSA 9, I think these were going raw around, like, the same thing as a Zappy, around 120-ish. Um... Bought this off of a dealer in the Louisville sports card show. And, you know, this stuff usually I could count on being some good nines, especially in vet stuff overall. All right, up next, a little hockey. I know, hockey. Boo, boo. Guys, I really thought this was going to be a nine, too, in my prediction. Gem Mint 10, Cider, Young Gun Rookie. These things used to be, I graded a Lucas Raymond and Cider originally. Uh, one of them got 220. I think that was Lucas Raymond. I think Cider got me like 180 at the time. These are now $60. Pretty freaking crazy how they dropped it. When you start looking at the pop counts, this is over 2,000 now. One that I'm very, very happy with 2018 19 Select D. Uh, Mitchell in flight signatures. This was still encased by Panini. So out of this, you'll see there will be in one, two, I think only three that were encased by Panini. Three that were encased. So this is number two that was encased. PSA 10 came back. 
Really nice card. Raw, these are around, I think, 90 bucks. So it definitely puts it up there. They're numbered on 99. But a lot of people up in a little, yeah, still booby fingers, still same video I'm doing from uh, yesterday. Um, but hopefully you pick up somebody up there. It'll be a big uh, Donovan Mitchell person, PSA 10 onto it. And I actually think the pop count in this was either like one or three. I can't remember. It was If it's not a one, it was a three. A lot of stuff I was in shock that I was the only person grading this stuff. Okay, last up. George Pickens, this was in case two. Got it from Sappy Sports Cards. Still sealed was a redemption. This is the Fusion Red Yellow PSA 10 George Pickens. Go Steelers, go this year. I had this as either a 9 or 10 coming back. So overall, I'm really happy the Durant. was the only thing that really shocked me out of the whole bunch. Uh, like, really, really shocked me, because most of this stuff I thought was going to be 9s or 10s across the board. And at $15 a card, it was more just getting a little bit of fresh inventory in for display cases. There is a show where I'm set up in two weeks. You know, you like to have a little bit of fresh stuff back in. I was really hoping there's an order I have like a 20 cards out. It's been an assembly now for about four or five days. I was hoping it would go through and then ship out like Monday next week, maybe Tuesday, and get it in before the show. But right now, it's not looking good for the home team on that one. But overall, like I said, pretty much where I thought it would be at. Some fresh stuff uh, that will be in the display case. I like to rotate my inventory. The bad part is, I was going to say this earlier, is the show's next Saturday. Then three weeks later, he hosts again in the same location. Uh, the Derby City one. And so I got to, like, turn all kind of new inventory within three weeks, and that's hard to do. Now, granted, during that time frame, you know, football will be changing with a lot of, oh, who's hot and who's not. Basketball might start getting looked at a little bit more. But I always like to have fresh stuff, so I think, you know, hopefully between I could pick up some new stuff between now and then that I don't have to grade out. Uh, stuff like that for the show. Baronet, pretty cool overall. Happy with uh, most part, all except for Durant. <laughs> it always happens every so often when my orders, something comes back, and I'm like, what the heck did I miss? So it just shows you that everything always comes back good that I put in. I do miss stuff every now and then. But all right, guys, that is it. I am out. Catch you next one.